Welcome to Trailers from Hell. I'm George Hickenlooper, and you're about to see a trailer for a film that scared the living shit out of me as a kid. The 1950s quintessential science fiction film, The Blob. My first exposure to this film was uh, as a kid in San Francisco watching Bob Wilkins' Creature Feature, which was basically my exposure to all horror pictures or science fiction pictures. And uh, this film just kept giving me nightmares over and over again of this giant kind of amoeba-like creature that just wanted to eat you. And I think as a kid, you 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 have these deep primordial fears about being consumed. And um, the film really stuck with me. And I used to draw pictures of the blob and 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 just have all these wild dreams. And we used to play games called the Blob using Jello. Um, so it really had a kind of a very strong impression. Steve McQueen, of course, probably if it wasn't for him this film wouldn't be put on the map at all. Uh, McQueen, this was the first picture he ever did, it was shot in, uh, in in Valley Forge in the Philadelphia area, Pottstown, Pennsylvania, where the uh, theater still stands. In fact, to this day, they have these annual celebrations, blob celebrations to this day. And the diners in nearby Valley Forge. And it was a low-budget science fiction picture made that uh, probably no one would have ever seen if had Steve McQueen not become a star on a TV show called Wanted Dead or Alive. And um, after that happened, the film started getting booked in drive-ins and, and built, a, I guess, a slow cult following over a few years until it uh, became a classic and uh, put McQueen on the map. Uh, obviously became a major star and one of the more iconic Hollywood uh, actors and, and, and one of my favorite actors. My, in fact, my favorite McQueen film, an underrated film, is Robert Wise's The Sand Pebbles. Um, and it's hard to th picture, you know, McQueen and the Sand Pebbles and McQueen and the Blob, which I guess shows his versatility as an actor um, or just plain stupid luck. But uh, this is a, a great science fiction picture. I, I think, you know, it, it's probably a little overrated, but um, for me it had a lot of childhood memories that, uh, that I just can't forget.